Hey, this is Behind the Scenes. You are in the Maco Tools Lucas Oil Toyota Top Fuel Dragster Pit. And as you're going to see, you're going to see what it's all about. As you walk down here, down the car, you're going to see this is what keeps the front end on the ground, which is known as our front wing. At certain angles, we manipulate at certain tracks. The thinner the air, the steeper the angle. The more dense the air, the lesser the angle. And as you work back, you can see how we tune everybody in. We have Sirius XM FVP. We got Hankster's metal working lubricants that keeps all of our tools and all of our machines right and tight with coolants and weight lubes that make all of our high performance parts. And as you see back here, this is, everybody has an office. This is AB's office right here. This is an office that goes 335 plus miles an hour. This is where I do all my work. Believe it or not, I only probably work behind the wheel about two minutes a year because we travel a thousand feet in 3.6 seconds and we do close to 200 laps a year. So believe it or not, I get paid a lot for an hour. <laughs> I get paid by the second. But the coolest part is, is that everything's fully bored and when you look inside the car, everything is fully digital and it's all brought up to speed where there's a whole bunch of technology that we use to manage this thing. And then you can see right here on top, what we love the most, GovX, and we have FDC. It's all about giving back to the community, especially for the military, the first responders, from the nurses to law enforcement, is one stop place to give them a thank you appreciation from a lot of companies that's willing to give them a little heads up, which I mean is a discount. So that's what it's all about. And as you work your way back to the back of the car, you can see our fuel pump engine, cylinder head on this side, this side's apart. You can see the piston sticking out. You can see the oil galley here in the middle. And it's very unique, but this is just for you so you can get an up close personal look that nobody can ever see. This is technology. I should cover it up. I'm just messing with you. You can take a look at it and then you can see a clutch pack wide open in the back of the car also. And you can see the clutch right there. That right there is the six disc clutch that controls close to 12,000 horsepower and it goes through there to put it in these Goodyear slicks to get it down the racetrack. That's what makes this ride so special. And one of the most crucial parts on the car is the back wing element. That's what keeps it back in on the ground. And then we have a wheelie bar. And then we also have our parachutes, which are made for us to slow down, which is very important for us to slow down. And that, that's not all. Have you ever seen the side of a top fuel trailer? Come take a trip with me. I'm going to the back back then. So when you come in, this is actually what we call our rod and pistons. You can see our rods stacked up, ready to go with wrist pins. Stacked up, ready to go. And as you walk here to the back, what we got going back here, fellas? Got, got a flywheel cut ready to go. We got another flywheel on top of here that's ready to go with that pack. There's like, like these race parts are, it's just like a deal that you have to go together, hand in hand. If they don't work right with each other, they're not ready to go. But this is one of my coolest parts right here is that uh, you get to see all of our rod and piston racks ready to go right here. That's the slugs that go into the gun. When we hit the gas pedal, that's the thing right there that makes the compression and makes all the power from the air and fuel being pushed together and making a BAM! Basically, this is our cylinder head department. As I swing them open, you can see our heads that are ready to go, lined up in order, which we got to sell in the car and the other ones are ready to go in competition. Ready to rock. The important part about making good power, you have to have a good cylinder head. But the other crucial area, area you have to have something that feeds it what it needs. Feed it the air it needs to burn the fuel. And this is what a supercharger is. This is a this is a Darren Mara performance engineering blower, and uh, it's pretty specific to what we need. But I think of them as the best blowers on the market, 
And when you step on the gas, it gives you that instant boost that you need to snap that car up and get it going. It's called HP Additor Squared. Not times, squared. If you're making, if you're making 6,000, it makes you make 12,000. That's what we do here. That's the cruise trees lounge right there. That's where all the magic happens right there. That's where they actually look at all the data. And that's where they look at all the, all the telltale stuff on the race car from the computer element, what goes on. So that's what makes it pretty special. What makes them go up there, our two crew chiefs, uh, Brian Karate and Mark Oswald, where they go up there to diagnose all the information and then they actually get it all together to actually make the car perform to the best of their abilities and as best as what the track can hold. We can always go fast, we can always uh, go quick, but you only go as fast as what the track can hold. So that's the main thing is be able to manipulate that and put it in the package, put it in the car and make it happen. It's been a good day that y'all hanging out with me. You saw my race car, you saw our two trailers. This is our home away from home, but now it's time to go back to work because we got some horsepower to lay on the ground and we got some rounds of wins, what equals the races to win, which equals the championships to win. So I want you to stay tuned for more stuff coming. And this is a GovX exclusive, and you heard it from me, Antron Brown. I'll check you later.